Francis Hopkins, the real person who designed the Stars and Stripes flag, was a Freemason. Francis Scott Key, the author of the words to the Star Spangled Banner, was a Freemason brother of Concordia Lodge No. 13. Pierre L'Enfant, who designed the layout of Washington, D.C., was a Freemason. John Stafford Smith, the guy who wrote the music to the Star Spangled Banner, was a Freemason. The Declaration of Independence was written on a Freemason apron. George Washington, the first President of the United States, was a Freemason. George Washington was not a Christian, he was a deist. That Statue of Liberty was designed by Freemason Edouard de Laboulaye. Have any doubts about what Freemasonry is? If you talk to a Freemason they will try to pretend like it is something else. So let's hear it directly from the horse's mouth. The following is a quote from Albert Pike, whose book, Morals and Dogma is required reading for Freemasons. That which we must say to the crowd is we worship a god. But is it the god that one adores without superstition? To you sovereign grand inspectors general, we say this, that you may repeat it to the brethren of the 32nd, 31st, and 30th degrees, the Masonic religion should be, by all of us initiates of the high degrees, maintained in the purity of Luciferian doctrine. If Lucifer were not God, would Adoni, meaning Jesus, calumniate, meaning spread lies about, him? Yes. Lucifer is God. It is not my fault that you have been lied to your whole life. Do not let pride cloud your eyes. Just because you have heard a lie from birth, does not make it true. If you have to do mental gymnastics in your head to discount what I am telling you, then that is the programming holding on to you. But you cannot refute that all of the evidence I have put forward is accurate. Wake up. Freemasonry is evil. What do you think of coexist bumper stickers? Where do you think that comes from? If you know what I am saying is true, and you do not speak up and say something, because you are scared of not fitting in with the rest of the group, then you are no different than Peter denying Christ three times as the rooster crowed. God will spit out the lukewarm. Jesus is the only way. The ways of the world are deception. God bless you all in Jesus' name.